shape aptitude questions first of all let's see this kind of questions you see here that we have no color so we have to look for two three things number one we have to see the shapes what kind of shapes they are are the shapes changing number two the position of different shapes and the and the relative positions of different shapes you know and number three is is there any orientation or movement you know something like clockwise movement of the shapes somehow you know or the shapes inside these squares you know or the big ones so let's use these three techniques to solve this question first of all let's let's say if, what are the, uh, first of all there are no colors so we have to we don't have to worry much about the color there's just black and white and we see that this is the small scales are are black and the uh, others are white so there's not much to look for the shapes now now we see the the outer shapes the outer shape is the box which is also then all of them are the same so we don't need to worry about this now let's see we have here our black boxes and some circles and let's see if there is some movement in them or some changing let's see the black box is here then it moves here then it moves here it moves here it moves in the middle it should move then here the black box because it's then in the middle and then at the edge so it's like something like a you know clockwise or anti clockwise movement of the black box first of all so first thing we know that we should have a black box here it means that yeah the black box is here black in all the shape in all the places black box is here so it doesn't mean anything so we have to look for something else something else is let's look let's look for these arrows for example this arrow is here now the arrow is here then the arrow is here so uh, is this arrow is here this arrow is here and this arrow is here so this way the arrows are like you know pointing towards each other so if this arrow is like this this arrow should be like this in this direction with the bottom down you know uh, with, the, with the with pointing down because this is like this so it should be like this here because of these two you see these arrows are the same and so we'll so they are kind of reflections of each other so we will have an arrow like this do we have arrow like this in any other shape no so it means c is the correct answer c is the correct answer for this question now let's see this question with the colors and shapes so here we have to also take care of the colors so let's see the shapes the outer shape is the same which is the box big box inner shape we have different inner shapes we have shapes with blue color and shapes with black color let's see okay so it seems that the bigger shape has always the blue color and one of the smaller shapes has black color so bigger shape has blue color we have to find in this in this in this question we have to find which one is the different the different one actually so which one is the different one let's see bigger shape is blue and arrow is black circle circle triangle scares so here should be the triangle black no so the bigger shape is blue okay and the shape at the bottom is always black this is black but the shape here at the bottom is not black and actually it's blue so c is the odd one this does not fit into this sequence so we found found out you know based on the shapes and their colors that this doesn't fit 